Uh, Here's Chris Radio operating. Radio He's uh, operating a White River Junction. Pairs, 505 and 760. Probably the first That must be 5. Must be because that's 745. Doing a bit of local switching and perhaps later on he may have to make up a train. Okay. I am making a train right now. Oh. He's actually making a train up here on the siding. Great. This one right over here. Oh, and I've got that lovely milk car. Yeah, big story behind those board and milk cars. Yeah. We have whistles. That's my story, Joel, and I'm sticking to it. Back it up. You can back it up, you'll wind up the pickle right into hiding. Apparently, you're taking all the cars with you. We have a refrigerator car about to go on the train. Later on we'll have to speak with David. I presume he scratch built the milk car. Yeah, you're good. You got like uh, four car links. You just have to switch there. There's the handsome and good looking Mr. Christopher Lai. <laughs> But he doesn't have a guitar in his hand. No, I don't. Oh, well. No, I'm well all strung out tonight. <laughs> oh, well, a, a throttle, we'll throttle it's in there. It's not often you capture me on uh, without own video. So. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. yeah it isn't it's often it's we an capture. Yeah. Yeah. And the way you're whipping that puppy around, you think you knew what you were doing. <laughs> just in behind Chris, Bob is uh, operating in St. Johnsbury. on the CP switcher. St. Johnsbury is quite the hub on David's layout. Well, it's actually quite the hub in the real world back in the 1950s and 60s. You want to come through now? Are you in the process of coming through the train? Yeah, I can uh, give you the main here in a second. Portland 1. Portland 1's over here. Yeah. So I'm going to come out from that hole. Yep. Okay. He'll set the switches for you. And here's Jim working the Newport Yard. Yeah. Forward over there. Yeah. Well, you know, Eric didn't realize that in his little uh, the diatrap there that he had done. And, there is and a we've got a turntable. Is the passenger ready to come through? And the engine house. Yeah, the passenger train's only 20, 20, 25 minutes late. Wait, hold on a second. Here, right? Prepare it through a second. Prepare it through a second. Well, remember, like a post note, that is sponsoring the Association of 545, which is like now 5. Right. Exactly. Until the ice was broken. Yeah. Hey, Pacific 7098 is on switching duties here at Newport. Meanwhile, back in Wells River, Bronze uh, making up the milk train. Passenger train will come in and it'll lift a series of milk cars around set aside. That one really wanted to get to market fast. And Ron's got a lovely road switcher that he's using here in Wells River. CPA for okay, Ron, how are we doing down there, buddy? You ready for me? No, I'm waiting for a passenger train first. Okay. But then I'll think about it. Okay. Sounds good. <laughs> Then they'll give you the green. <laughs> well, once the passenger train through his freight, I can put the engine around and you're good to go. Okay, sounds good, partner. I'll be right here. Passenger train is waiting at the red light, so anytime. We're good to 
You got a green. Oh, that way. Fine. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Sheesh. And we get a helicopter view. That is passenger train. We are in a Boston, Maine, 4258. Arriving Wells River. And the passengers just reached the platform. Oh, it looks like the freight's more important because the <laughs> passengers got to know how to hike it. They got a long walk. <laughs> and here we see uh, this north end staging. David's built it in to a lovely shelf with this gorgeous, gorgeous workbench area he has. And we have the fast clock up above. And a visit to David Primo's beautiful Con River Line layout would not be complete without a look at his lovely round bar. Yep, you're green. Although you're too far to see the green, you are green. <laughs> and as always, there's a lot of fun band. So Fred, what's new? Not much, Mike. I'm just over here enjoying this great layout again. Awesome job. Yeah. Well, you're doing a great job, Larry. Great job, great boy. Great job, I okay, say. Jock McKay. This is the crew lounge where David and Norm are waiting their assignments. Okay. So yeah, what's there the, is what's a dairy down here. Yeah. There is a lumber yard. Yeah. Yeah. This side is the... There's no work involved. There's no work that's going south to Lake River Junction later on. Yeah, that's a long south. This is local south, perfect. Yeah. Boat River. And this is north, which is actually I just sent it. North is from staging there, yeah. So you said you had to bring some of this traffic down here, Jim, still? These need to be parked. So I was going to go around, I was going to run around. Okay. I have found that with that, I work on his, the, um, the hanging down the, that's the right, hoses, yeah. Yeah. and that's the way I See, found I've, it. I've clipped all my hoses off. That is, oh, that is. He's power routed. Do you want to just check my switch down at the head in there? So there's no power if it's... That's good. And that one's yeah. good, but what about the, the lead going out? Well, you're not going out okay. anyway. Uh, the lead going out's good. Okay, good. So you, so you can switch? switch? Now, you may do it differently. I was just going to leave here and put the cars on the front end. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if you would like to where, where do it differently. We're going tested? that way. Oh. Okay. These are just being put, put in, in the, the yard. yard. Okay. So we'll go. We'll grab them and we'll just drop them in the yard. For I tend to use the uh, these seem to work pretty well. The, uh, the uncoupler. Oh, okay. Then we're gonna get this uh, switch here. Well, you can't. You can't see the button. You're on the wrong one, so, so I think this one. So okay. You don't tend to use that one. Oh, that's the way I. I'm taking it. That far one over there is a light. No, sir, I want to get this for you. Here's what color it is. Okay. Okay. Now I want to back down. I want to get. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. He, he, he was going to do the same thing, but then we're both yeah. in the yeah. Do you want to give me that? I'll just a couple of the... Uh, do you use the metal wire or do you use the little pointer? I used the little pointer for a while, and then I watched it. Yeah. I saw that was the way it goes, and he's got a little hole here if you want to park it. If you don't like parking it there, just adjust the coupler here. Looks like it's a little eye coupler. Well, these I, three I'm are going somewhere. My brain being where it is. Yeah. It wasn't so much green as the numbers on the curve. Oh, the green on Yeah, yeah. yeah. 
Police recon car. Or, or whatever. Yeah. They're being parked. Yeah. No matter which one we So you don't actually need to worry about it. What I didn't know is which slots to put them in. Where's the investigation? They're not going north. Yeah, you certainly don't have to worry too much. The boxes are there for you to just put stuff in. You don't have to worry. Just put it in local? Okay. So here we go. This is possibly that's the, the only one you've got going back. Yeah, there's just one car going right there. Okay. So now uh there we go. Oh, that must have spilt the coffee. Yeah, I think so. That locomotive is very touchy. Which is a kind of So a 128 step? 249 yep. box. Brown. This is CP. Yeah, this is my trailer. Oh, yeah, CP. It's got CP markings on it. You look at the reporting mark. Oh. Yeah. I did. It said Montreal and Atlanta. <laughs> no, that's, that's, that's not the reporting That's mark. not that's the reporting label. Mark. I'll try to be magnetic on copper just to see. Yeah, we did. We did. We bring everything up. Works well if you get it lined. Okay. Direction. <laughs> then I just shove it on. Oh, no, I just leave it like that. I guess. No, I just leave it. Yeah. Excellent. All you have to do is when you want to make up a train, if you do that, you'll find you've got a bunch of uncoupled things. Yeah. Because they were on delay on a couple and you exactly. push them. Well, here I'm just going to get pushed out. So. Sir James. When somebody wants to come in, do you know about the green yeah. so light where's switch? The, uh, it's right it's here. There. And where's the light, lights down there? This car on the other side of that caboose. So you're going to have to run around. Yeah. So what we'll do is the uh, CPR northbound turn come through yet? You know? I have no idea. Mm. Yeah, I didn't think it would work. Someone else I wasn't sure if that switch down there was lined up. You may make it up or you may switch it. Yeah. So we'll so and I'm just out of curiosity. Yeah. Yeah. So the so Newport the Yard to marshal all those cars once they get there. So they all go in the same train? Yep, they all go in the same train. So they'll all be lifts by that Slips. northbound. I'm sorry. Constantly trying to trace out where the heck it is. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to run this down there and then leave my engine just parked here. What we have here are two empty milk cars getting ready to be picked up, or two loaded milk cars rather, to join the other loaded one there, all heading to Boston. Down to the dairy tonight in the evening. And all that milk will be pasteurized overnight and bottled and delivered to consumers in the Greater Boston area tomorrow morning. All right, thanks, Rhett. Uh, oh, here's my throttle. Yeah, do you have the The card's in here. Here, I noticed that your switcher there has a really interesting heater on it. Yeah, it's um, literally what it is. It was so they could park it overnight without having to leave it running all the time. You could heat it with its own diesel fuel. Are you sure? a big bunch of this batch here. Yeah, I think. Yep. Yeah. 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 yeah, these are all your lifts. There's a lot there. And I expect you're going back on the same track. This no. tells you which. Come on. I forget what the name is. I have a train coming in, 8400 from yeah. Wells River. Yes. And and right? What happens to it? Or to well, uh, I have an envelope here that tells you what happens to it. Are you by any chance in northbound that's supposed to take a whole lot of stuff or just coming through? No, he's coming. It's your northbound. I'm a northbound. It's oh. your way freight. My way, yeah. Best bet's to bring him in here, so see if he's got anything. Turn this mark. I'm only leaving it to you. Yeah. I'm enjoying your layout for once. Yeah, it's uh, <laughs> you guys are good enough now that I don't have to babysit you all the time. It's great. It's also fun to see the things sort of 
Monday working the way it's supposed to work, and yeah. it has been tonight. Everything yeah. running. You guys are really got a case now. Okay, northbound stop. Quebec City. Wait a sec, come to an emergency I'm stop. I have a problem, uh, Dave, because I'm running two passenger trains and they're supposed to meet. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's okay. okay. I think you can actually. Well, you can come forward over to this point. Okay. Yeah. So you can bring this one in, I'll swap them. Yeah, it'll the locals? Okay. okay, good. Yeah. Or I'll just handle 76. I'll look after 76. And you look after the other one. Good enough. Yeah, work. Two car. Wait a minute. Change the line. It's good. It running it's good. Super Vermont stuff. You can bring 76. You can turn the bell off because okay. you're going to be here all, for a while. Okay. The B and M <laughs> unit on. Okay. Tell me when you're ready, Norm. Get rid of the I'll phone unit. you. All right. Okay. <laughs> and then you'll have the other guy. Okay. Okay, you got a CP272, the milk. I, I, I see a milk card there. I'll pull that out. Yeah. Is, there, is there information on that? Um, yeah. Um, here's the deal. That's an empty one. So you can just set that box aside. Here's your loads. Okay. Well, here are your milk loads. It's not a lot to start working on. But when you get the uh, opportunity now, you might as well start to put that together. This guy's now loaded. Yeah. And you want I want to put a caboose here? on the back. 271 place there that if you <laughs> Different form of digital control. And the original army digital control. Yeah. It's the original Digitrax. That's when you pull the guy in the sternum. I'll uh, put it up to. Right on the bridge. It looks pretty on the bridge. Here. here. Oh. Turn it off. Uh, okay. We had some unexpected visitors down here. What? What? Oh no, nothing to do with you. <laughs> they have cats? Okay, now you're cleared out. I'm thinking of Brent. Oh, there he is. Okay. <laughs> What's the visit? As long as I didn't screw up. No, you didn't screw up. There's that much more momentum on the table. Okay, I'm going to uncouple you from that train. Should I have a station further? Just draw a bit ahead. Follow me. Must have been a magnet on that caboose. That's good. And where do I park the locomotive? Uh, draw forward a bit. So I'll get rid of that we're string take you down here. here. And we're going to just park you down in here for now. Okay, good. No, we'll put you on this side. Okay. Just to get you out of the way. More. Okay, that's good. Okay, if you can acquire 4265. There you go. And in reverse, it will pay. You're backing her out of West Lebanon. Okay. Unfortunately, it doesn't have sound. Sound is so nice. Yeah, you can actually like ring the bell. Ring the bell or something. Yeah, you know she's going. Here she comes. Okay. Just back her down on the train. This is the southbound ambassador dropping off at Central Vermont locomotive and picking up a couple of Boston and Maine F units. Perfect. All the girls. We have clearance to leave.
Who didn't last anything for her to write her? Yeah. She was on the phone with emails constantly. What it is is, uh, I guess, welcome to the class. As soon as he's parked, we're bringing the north down the road. Oh, avertissement. Oui. Vous avez deux trains de passagers qui passent d'habitude chez toi bientôt. Northbound and southbound Alouette. Uh, so you just want to check your schedule to see when you want to clear those two tracks, the platform drops. Pretty damn soon, I would expect. And if it proves to be impossible chez vous, you can always do the pass at Wells River if need be. Jack Scott's observation on the back end. It's a real nice model of CPR observation. So what's the history of the Jack Scott car? You know Jack Scott? He's the chap with the CPR Rocky Mountain layout over here in Beacon Hill. Or in yes. Yes, they do. It's a lovely layout. That's he built that or modified that from a, some kind of other car, and he bequeathed it to the Alouette because it desperately needed the Cafe Observation Lounge. So he said, "Here, run it on your layout." Wow. Mr. Red. Here's where, for purposes of the, the exercise, now he's filming it, see? So when the locomotive's gone by, now we see the same old red. Well, the signal turns red after the locomotive was going by. Yeah, I was fast running there to get past the throw it. So I'm lined up, Norm. You got me lined up? Yes. Mikey's engines always need a push. Which <laughs> time? Thank you. 